Live from Planet Los Angeles, it is I, Arif S. Kenshin. How you guys doing out there, my ignorance? We're here with Andrew Ray. What's going on? Say what's up, man. What's up? This is the world. <laughs> the World Wide Web. What's up? This young man here is part of the MoCap All-Stars. Uh, it's a, bit, it's a, a version of acting that brings to life your video games and all your CGI uh, media whether it be Avatar or things like Saints Row the second or the third but it also has a phenomenal theater degree so break us down on your history and where you come from. Well I have a, a master's degree in uh, theater performance with emphasis in stage movement uh, I'm from Lexington, Kentucky uh, Got my master's degree. Louisiana and what State team is that? Universe, uh, what, what team Kentucky is that? Wildcast, the national yeah, yeah. champion. Got to let him get that out. Wildcast. <laughs> yeah, got a big we're... game tonight. Too, so, yeah. And Louisiana, you did what? And, uh, Louisiana, I went to Louisiana Tech, who's currently 9-1 and one and ranked 20th in the country. And football. what did you study there? I studied theater. Yes. Now, this man is uh, yeah. what I would call the Conan of stage combat. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> little is known of a man that can play two of, two of the baddest guys in video games. This man is Pierce, and he is Gat. That's known on the web. It's known everywhere. <laughs> These are legal comments. Uh, how do you approach them? You were telling me the other day how you did, but could you share with them how you approach doing your job? Yeah, I mean, the, the, the reason that Pierce and Gat are, are such wonderful characters to play, it has a lot to do with you and, and with, with Daniel De Kim, who do the voice work. Because really, my job is to sync up with the with the voice actor's performance and just make it look like one person. So you're really creating a character with someone that well, I finally met you. I've met Daniel yet, but you know I, I'm working with someone that I've, a lot of times I've never met. Uh, trying to sync up with the voice actor and the voice performance. Um, that's the way we kind of do it. And it's just about you know bringing that character to life and being true to that character, just like any actor does in, in a performance. Now, albeit that. Uh, CGI and video games are new media. How have the classic trainings taught you to handle this kind of job? Well, I have a, a really strong base in stage combat. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a theatrical fight director. I'm a certified teacher with the Society of American Fight Directors. I do a lot of work up and down the East Coast and across the Southeast. Um, and that type of training, because of the way it breaks down um, the physical use of the body, um, you become very, very comfortable just moving through space, mm -hmm. and that really helps in motion capture because you have very, a very short amount of time to pick up on what you're supposed to do and what your count is and what your marks are, and then make it look real and organic as if it's happening right there and it's not marked out and set. Um, and, and so, <clears throat> on the stage combat background, um, combined with the, all the acting training that I've had over the years, really kind of caters to this type of work, in my opinion. Let me just tell you this. In the power trailer, when he's throwing people and socking Oleg or the, or the clone looking, well, he's, he was, he, you were beating up an enemy and then it made it look like it was Oleg when yeah. the cut got put together. But just the way the punch was thrown, I was like, that was cool. And then I got to meet him and I was like, what? This guy is freaking awesome. <laughs> So that means to you, kitties, get your training before you try to come into the new school world with all your newfangled ideas. Sometimes you got to use the old to bring the new to the present. I mean, it is what it is. So, uh, how can they find you on Twitter? Uh, find me on Twitter. It's at adr612. Okay, and um, uh, you got fan page on Facebook. I don't have a fan page on okay, Facebook. Okay, we got to get. We're but gonna, if we're I get enough Twitter followers, then I'll make a fan page on Facebook. Exactly. So, so and, get me up on Twitter. And what do you? Uh, you teach as well. What, what, I what do, do you do? I do. I teach. Um, I'm a freelance stage combat instructor with the Society of American Fight Directors. So I teach all over the country. Uh, so if you guys are anywhere and you really want to learn how to get down with some Hollywood and new media type of uh, stage combat, you might want to look this guy up. And he has a whole team. Like I said, the MoCap All-Stars can be in your town and teach you exactly what you're supposed to know. Your teacher isn't crazy. They're making you learn that for a reason. Yes. You don't want a bad fall or break a hip. Yeah. <laughs> I want to do, we want to do physical stuff when we're filming. I want to be the 60-year-old dude who's still doing stunts. You can be. It's still, it's still falling all over the place. That's and, the idea. And without a cane. Yeah. You'd be able to get possible. up and go, go to the club still. Well, probably not a club when I'm 60, but... <laughs> At least in the production office. Yeah, yeah. Go to the go to the rap party and be able to dance with, with uh, attractive young uh, actresses. Top three hip-hop groups. Top three hip-hop groups? Yeah. Oh, 
Um, number one, I'll go with the Roots. Okay. I love the Roots. Mm -hmm. um, ooh, let's see here. I'll go with the Tribe Called Quest. Okay. And you know what? I'm in L.A., so let's go with N.W.A. Okay. Because they changed everything. Okay. Okay. You see that? There's a bunch more like that. But there's so many more. There. Yeah. <laughs> see? He put me on the spot. Okay. Throw throw out, throw out a couple more. Throw out some more. <laughs> I, I tell you what, I'll give you a, I'll give you a new one, okay. a really new one. It's more like a, just a group since I'm on the West Coast okay. again. Uh, the Black Hippie. Movement, oh yeah, those guys are cool. Lamar and Absol and and, and Schoolboy Q and, and J Rock. So I'm really digging. And what about the kind of kind of linguist? And, uh, cunning linguist, uh, <laughs> yeah. Represent. I'm from Kentucky originally, so cunning linguist and um, Nappy Roots. Yes. Hit up Nappy Roots because they they put, constantly put out phenomenal work. It ain't but just video game. games on sets, people. We have to have a soundtrack. Yeah. <laughs> so cool. Well, thank you very much, A Ray, for hooking um, up with us. No and the Twitter name one more time so we don't it's forget it. At ADR612. Very good. This is Mobile Ignorance, behind the scenes sessions. All right, guys.